Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome to It Lurks Below. This just hit Steam Early Access yesterday and it's a game I've kind of been looking forward to. I knew it was in the works. Um, and this is a game by the creative lead of the first two Diablo games, Diablo 1 and 2. Uh, and this is a Diablo meets Terraria type of game as far as I know. I haven't put any time into it. I wanted my first impressions to be raw just for you because I know you two like it raw. So let's uh, start up and see what this game has to offer and see if it's anything worth playing for more than an episode. Let's check it out. Uh, new character. Randomize. Uh, well, we, we can mess around a little bit here. Um, let's go with the closest thing to me as possible. Boring and brown. Uh, nope. Mm, yeah, sure. I'm just looking for more brown hair. Accessories. That's great pink lips. Uh, sure. Character class. Ooh, okay, there's classes. Cleric. Divine healing for yourself and retribution for your enemies. Enchanter. Taps into the enemy's mind to alter their reality. Necromancer. Necromancer. <laughs> Necromancer. Plays with life and death in creative and malicious ways. Rogue. Lurk deep. Uh, wizards. Magic. Bard. Music and song. Let's go with Necromancer to start. I think that's more fun. I, I, that sounds like a lot of fun. Enter name. Mathis. Because that's... I'm original. Choose game style. Standard, hardcore, creative. Uh, creative. An easier version of the game with many free recipes. No hunger, no stamina. Standard, the default version. Hardcore. A difficult version of the game. When your character dies, the game ends. This game is very difficult. Uh, let's try standard for the first one. Maybe a hardcore series if this people love what they see, but we'll worry about it later. It is important to do quests. They give you tools and advance the game. Okay. The most common way to die early is to not have enough food. Please farm. Okay. Oh! Okay. Hello. Whoa! All right. All right. All right. Let's take a look. Starting off right. Vile demons abound in these dark woods. You must defend yourself. Pick up two sticks from the ground. Uh, craft a wand. Okay. So we can pick up gr sticks from the ground. Can I sprint? All right. That's that. I need sticks, though. In the top left looks like a health, sanity, hunger, and stamina. I don't know how... I don't know how to sprint, if at all. There's a stick. There's another stick. All right, we want to craft. Magic magic wand of spark. We'll go ahead and put that there. Oh, we got a, by magic wand, you mean a gun? Also, this game is extraordinarily loud, which I guess we'll all just do in post. But for me, it's loud as hell. Let's keep grabbing things. Can I? All right, can't do anything there. I'll grab him with a rock. Can't really bust anything. All right, I did it. Uh, survival of the fittest. Things are never easy, and this is no exception. We are all depending on you to survive. Gather some food and eat it. Extract some seeds by pressing E. Uh, rest to regain energy. Well, so three. Okay. How, what? Gather food and eat it. How do I eat it? I have food. Okay, I have to click on it here. Good. We'll extract some seeds and we'll Z to. Oh, we're napping. We're napping. We're napping. It's beautiful. Quest complete. If you're going to need to construct construct tools to survive and fight in this war, craft a simple pickaxe, craft an axe. All right, we've, we've learned some new things. This is very Terraria esque. We need a lot more sticks and rocks. So, can we, can we make anything yet? I need three. I need grass. I holding shift does not sprint. Just so you know. So I'm not. I can't go any faster than I am. This is all. This is as fast as I can go. Bottom, bottom, bottom. I'll take that. I'll take that. Cabbage. Sure. Eat. We're full. All right. Can I just get some cabbage? That looks like Satan's grass. Also known as marijuana. All right. Um, pickaxe or an axe? Let's go with the axe first. Okay. Down it goes. I assume I'm just getting it all. I guess I am. I'm getting the wood, baby. Daddy loves wood. All right. Uh, we'll get a gun. That looks like basically like the worst thing ever. More grass, more grass. 
Uh, what do we need right now? We need more sticks and more grass. So one more tuft of grass should be enough. And if we can get another stick, we're in good shape. So boom and boom. Uh, that wasn't enough sticks. I need another stick. Game, you gotta hook me up here, game. What am I supposed to do? I should have made a pickaxe first. All right. But ah, uh, we did it. Congratulations, you have gained a level. You earned a point to spend on your attributes. Click the level up button. Is that what this is? Ooh, vitality, intelligence, and wand recharge rate. Why don't we go intelligence for mana? I am a necromancer, supposedly, even though I have a gun. Learning, uh, learning potion. Sometimes items can be used without changing which slot is highlighted. These instant use items have a special border around the slot. Pressing the key associated with the slot uses them. Place the learning potion into a numbered slot on your main bar. Quaff the potion by pressing any key. So I just go like this, I assume? And I can just be like, Glorp! Well fed. We did it. Dig up a cobblestone, craft and place a forge, craft and place a workbench. You're gonna need a base of operations. Hell yeah, we are. This looks like cobblestone to me. Let's go. It's a little rough around the edges. You can tell just the animation itself is a little rough right now. But, uh, you know, I, I like, I really like Terraria and I, I always get the urge to go back and play it, but you know, I have too many things going on right now to really worry about it. Um, but I, I'm telling you, like any any Terraria type of game, I really enjoy because I'm I'm just a dork like that, that that like adventure Zelda style survival mix them up, mix them up. You know what I mean? It's just it's a lot of fun for me. Okay, let's grab that. So I need to make craft in place a forge, craft in place a workbench. So right now I need a workbench, which is easy. But I need to forge first, and I need more cobblestone, which is going to be all of this. Well, it's getting late. We're going to have to sleep soon. Well, I don't know. There, I'm assuming there's a day-night cycle. And the sun, yeah, you can see the sun going down in the back. It's, it, honestly, this is reminding me similarly of, like, what early Terraria was like. You can see the promise in it right away. Um... And you can immediately tell, like, this doesn't feel like an, uh, uh, just an instantaneous cash grab. Like, he's clearly put some work into this. And I'm curious, you know, what it could turn into in the future. Come on. Grab that. I guess stamina just gradually goes down, but we are at the best numbered stamina right now, so. Grab that. Okay, we've got a forge now. So actually, what I'm going to do is um, maybe over here, like right next to the cobblestone. Uh, that's a monster. That's a monster. Oh! Whoa! That's more monsters. More monsters. I hey! Hey! Okay, okay, okay. We're good. 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 I need to build this. Portable forge. Got it. Uh, craft and place a workbench. Handy workbench. Do we just have like a regular workbench? No. All right. I'm actually going to carve this out and maybe build like a wall over here if we're going to have to deal with that kind of bullshit. But I need iron bars. Shift and right mouse to pick up. Okay. How do I actually just use it though? Okay. That's how we pick it up. Got it. That's not what I meant to do though. I don't know how to use it. How do I, how do I, I need iron bars. Oh, Jesus. Hey, I'm a necromancer. You're supposed to be on my team, Zombo. You're vomiting on me, and I don't appreciate that, but uh, appreciate that at least. Cool. Yo, the, the, the loot system is a lot of fun already. Well, what we can do at the very least is maybe put uh, some walls down. Well, why don't we make a door, actually? Oh, I can't. I need a workbench. Shit. I need iron bars then. I need iron ore. So I need to start looking for iron ore. I can't see anything. So let's start plopping this these down. We'll put the cabbage away. Oh, and I, I love that it actually automatically goes into my inventory. I don't have to mess too much with it. Okay. 
Well, I'm a necromancer in name only right now. It's like me in high school. I told people I was popular, but just because you say it doesn't necessarily make it true. Trust me, I tried. I just want to get a little lower, see if I can find some iron. I'm a little nervous to go too deep down, though. Uh, that's a that's a that's a thing with a gun. That thing has a gun. That thing has a gun. Uh, all right, that was a weird thing. Also, F automatically for torches is dope. I like that a lot. Okay, wrong buttons. All right, we're going for an exploration. Um, hello? Hmm. Hopefully there's no fall damage, and if there is, it's minor. Hello? Oh, so even if you, you even though it ha is highlighting my pickaxe, I actually didn't have the pickaxe all out. Well, I'm a little nervous to go deep down already, but we'll do what we got to to make this work, man. Well, wrong button. Yeah, what we should do is reload this thing just in case. It says something that the bullets are really only just square pixels right now and not particularly... What the fuck? Uh... Not particularly... There we go. Graphically impressive, but there's some cool stuff. Ooh, there's still some cool stuff you can do with it. And it's, it's really satisfying to shoot. There's also a torch down here. Signs of life, perhaps. Whoa! Yes, please. We need to eat some food. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, we got ants, it looks like. What do we get? Sweet, iron bar. We're gonna get all this iron real quick. And there's like a rune down there? I want it. Uh, and also, hacking at these things with a shitty pickaxe is killer. the progress being made on that. That's a lot of things. That's a lot of, that's a lot of nasty things. I'm trying to like, maybe build like a wall that I can just walk across. That works enough. All right, wall, 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 wall. Block it all off so they can't get to me. And let's get down here, see what the hell this is. And hopefully it doesn't kill me immediately. But whatever it is, I want it. And I'm gonna take all the iron I can, I can more or less carry. Uh, I hope eventually there's like a way for me to quickly teleport home. Here, let's grab this. Just kind of push through a little bit. It's weird, is that, are those blocks 3D? I think they're 3D. Yeah, you can see as you turn, they actually rotate as you walk away from them. All right, so it's not all 2D, there's 3D involved. That's kind of cool. They have a bunch of gold over there. I wonder if I can get some good sniper shots at these guys. That skeleton has a ponytail. She's just adorable. The shrine glows, but nothing happens. Okay. Uh, Alright then. That's a shame. I'm not quite sure what to do with it then. Hopefully I didn't waste it. here. I wonder if I can get shots off or not. Whoa, 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 whoa. Man, 
That is real rough. I have a healing potion. Come on, I want the money. Alright, we did it. We did it, we did it. First dungeon delve successful as far as I'm concerned. We can uh, get the hell out of here. And uh, make home, make way home with our newfound treasure. We got what we needed. Oh, we're getting very sleepy. I could probably sleep down here though, no problem. Let's try it. Good night. Snoozing. All right, hopefully a bed is faster. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. We probably need to start farming soon as well. There we go. Perfect. The old Terraria jump up while you place some blocks under you kind of thing. No. You're pooping out nasties. What is this? Scroll of blessing, right mouse button to pick up. Sure. Still stop it though, all right. Hang on. No! Stop! No! All right, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. I need to make a goddamn workbench. I need wood now, flupper. I use a lot of it. How are we looking now? Almost. Hello, anybody got wood? You know what I'm saying? I'll take it. I need food anyway, so going out this way is maybe not a bad idea. Uh, except there's just nothing out here, apparently. Why is wood so difficult to come by? All right, let's go. I'll take that. Give me all of it. I know, I'm very tired. If we could get like a house up with a bed and stuff, that would be ideal. God damn it. I'm very bad at aiming. I'm very bad at aiming. Just no. Leave me alone. I'm a very sleepy boy too. I leveled up. Uh, maybe some vitality would be good. A little bit of extra health. But please, let me get home and get everything up and working. Huh? Why can't I? Okay. There we go! We did it! We got a hoe! Keep, uh, you will become hungry as you adventure. You'll need to create a farm and grow crops. Create a dirt mound using a hoe. Plant any seed in the dirt. Sure, let's do it. Let's, uh, let's clear out a little patch right here. Now we're gonna make our own little farm. I'm getting very tired. Unfortunately, I need to sleep a little bit. It's 10 p.m., so it doesn't matter. It seems like at nighttime is whenever things happen. Monsters come out whenever they feel like it. Yikes, yikes. Also, when I sleep, things go a little faster than I'm prepared for. Thank you. All right, now let's go ahead and put down some seeds. Seeding it up. Okay, there we go. Quest complete. As you plant, harvest, mine, cook, and fish, you will gain survival experience. As you adventure your survival rank, uh, as you advance survival rank, you will have options on how to improve. Open your survival panel by clicking on the green plus or by using V. Well, we'll just click it for now. Hell yeah. Skill trees, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Crops last 25% longer in the world before rotting. 50% more chance of getting a street of seed from a crop. Learn to create fertilizer out of compost. Double the stack size of all crops. Murder a goblin. I jumped into that bullet. P 
pick crops last 25% longer before rotting. I don't really know. Let's go higher chance of getting seeds and uh, down to 75%. Hang on, hang on. Stop it. I'll take that though. Okay, reload. We did it. Craft some iron armor, craft an improved wand, kill Commander Vile on the surface. Prepare for the fight below by outfitting yourself for battle and killing Commander Vile. So our first, like, quest. So we have all kinds of stuff that we need to make, which is with a bunch of iron bars. All right, well, that's what I was hoping for. Uh, let's go, iron, oh, mother. Stop, stop it. I just want this. I need an anvil. Ah, oh, shit. No! Listen, I just want to live in the nature of, of happy life. Thank you. Uh, sure. Helmet. I look like a dork, but let's do it. I need more, I need more, uh, iron. I need, I need, I need a place that I can call quiet home. So let's just do like that. Um, shit. He's gonna poop monsters. Into my house! All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Q. Boom. Quick little hut. Can they get in? No. They cannot. We can sleep peacefully here, which is what I want. I need to sleep. It's fine. Go ahead and poop monsters all you want. I'm getting very hungry, actually, now that I think about it. Eat it. Eat it. We're gonna extract seeds from that. Keep sleeping. And I guess, like, this is where I'm gonna freaking stop my episode for today. I want that, but I can't get it. There we go. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna stop the episode here for today. I'm gonna play a little more. Uh, maybe one or two episodes, we'll see. Uh, I'd be curious to see if people want to see more, but if you are enjoying it, let me know in the comment section below by hitting the like button. Your support means the world to me, and as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye-bye.